Hi everyone, Craig here, youtube.com slash level epic, playing uh, The Walking Dead. This is episode two. We're just on the loading screen right now, waiting for it to load. So, uh, how, how have you guys been doing? You been doing good? Scared? Scared of the zombies? They're everywhere, man. Like, Dead Island, Walking Dead, Free Daisy. Everywhere. I know who you are. I got Watch another out. good one for you. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when... You got it, boss. <laughs> One of them is bitten. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. All right, I think he's gonna die. That's if I have a choice, he's gonna probably die. Just saying. Uh, blah 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 blah. Let's go. Zombies for oh, you want me to kill him? Gotcha. Sorry, I didn't realize that uh, it was waiting for me. Damn it. What'd they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well, that's another meal lost. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. Last night I heard your friend Doug laying in bed just naming types of pie. <laughs> it was driving me nuts. I think That's he's funny. starting to lose it. He's not the only one. Won't you cut him some slack? Yeah. You're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. Where's my mouse? What the? You'll have to ask Lily. Oh. She's the one handling the rations. Okay, well... Or mishandling it, if you ask Kenny. He's just worried about his kid getting enough. I worry about Clementine, too. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time... Things are getting pretty tense back at the motor end. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. He's got a wife and son to look out for. And they're safest in a big group. Going out on his own will get them all killed. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. <laughs> Larry's just uh, looking out for his Trying to be polite. Hey, I know Lily. She can take care of herself. He needs to take that energy and put it towards finding us some more food. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. Three months ago, though, like, should be able to get over it by now, I'd imagine. Three months is a long time, especially if you're, like, interacting with them every day. You might not like them, but... Still. Uh... It's a long shot. I'd hate to waste the bullets. Trust me. 
If I don't think I can hit it, I won't shoot. I got an axe. I'm not worried about zombies. Ah! Shit! Was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on! Erg. What's going on over here? Oh, there, Jesus trap. Christ. Oh, shit. No, no. Please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher. We'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off. Get it off. I like how everyone's got hunting get rifles off, now. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp, and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? It's okay. We're not gonna hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, just let us go. We're not a threat to you. Kid, chill out. We'll try to help you, but you gotta shut the fuck up. Lee, this is fucked up. We've gotta help you. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. We gotta get him out of there. Oh God, thank you. Fine, but you gotta hurry. <laughs> hurry, please, hurry. <laughs> Lee, the trap's been altered. There's no release latch. Oh no. <laughs> Shit, walkers! It's now or never, Lee. Please, get me out of this. Mark, get the boys back. You've already used your gun, you might as well just... Those walkers off of me. Really? Is that what we're gonna do? You have to get him out. You have to! Just get me out! Stop! How would somebody do this? Blood screaming? We're gonna be surrounded any minute! Please! Oh God! Get me out! Save him! Try to cut the chain! Why is this happening to us? This is so not gonna work. You can't cut a chain with a friggin' axe. Especially if there's like not a rock underneath of it. Is he gonna make it? Forget it. We use chain like that at the Air Force oh Base to lift Thornton. Oh You're not cutting through there. Come on. Try something. It has to be now. There There's we go. There's gotta be something we can do. This is gonna take forever. That's There's a freaking thick tree. Damn it, Lee. Yeah. Cut off his fucking leg. You don't have He's so much blood I'm so gonna die because really of this guy. Around. Try something I want my leg. I want my leg. <sighs> Come on, do something. What? There has to be a way out of this. <laughs> Jesus, I need to walk. Lee, I can't keep him back forever. Oh, God. Sorry, guy. I'm gonna have to catch him out. No, no, no. Try the trap again. Anything. Oh, God, please. there's so many of them. Fuck, I'm just wasting ammo now. We gotta go. <laughs> yeah, that would hurt. Oh. That should be through by now. Yeah? It's through? Oh. Come on. Sorry, dude. Let's get out of here. Is he? He passed out. But he's not bleeding, or much. <laughs> Maybe he's bleeding a little bit. Behind you! Travis! Come on, come on, we gotta move! Way to go, Elite Forces guy. Actually, I guess he was in Elite Forces, his father was, so. His sacrifice saved us all. Saved us? His sacrifice saved us all. He's a hero. Even though he's just. A fool, because he doesn't know how to walk backwards or forwards. Why didn't he turn around and run? Especially after we said, you know, look out, there's someone behind you. That's ridiculous. Whatever. Just saying. Oh, so hungry. So hungry.
That's such it's so depressing. Like I'm sure that's the atmosphere they're trying to portray, but still, it just seems really depressing. And they didn't cut down the trees? Why wouldn't you do that? You have an axe. Why don't you cut down the trees? And then burn them for firewood. And heat and cooking and all that kind of stuff. Cut down all the trees. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? Come on! Come oh on! My God. How could they not hear all what the gunshots they did earlier? Don't have time to explain. Please, Shit. Are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken. Lee. I, I don't know. Lee! What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? No, I don't. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. He would have died if we left him. So what? We are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group, right here, right now. Oh, this family's angry. Come on, me. Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine, you guys fight it out then. Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. But, what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. It doesn't matter who's in charge. Those people are here now. I guess we just have to decide what happens next. No, Lee, it does matter. One person can't be in charge of everything. You know, it might feel safe for you to sit on the fence, but sooner or later you're gonna have to decide whose side you're on. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? You think this is easy for me? Everyone's starting to hate me because I'm the one that rations the food. But nobody else wants to. You know what? I'm not doing it tonight. You do it. There's today's food rations, but there's not enough for everyone. Good luck. Eat it all yourself. That would be awesome. Just eat it in front of everybody. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Ten hungry people. How many people are in this group? That's that's ridiculous. Well, well, um, I guess she's our medic? Is that how this is gonna go? Is he gonna be okay? I don't know. Can you give me a hand real quick? Sure. What do you need? Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this, sewing up people's injuries. But I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but Lee, this man has no leg. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check in on the others. I need a little space here anyway. Alright, let's go check on the others. Let's go check on the others. Um, go for a walk. Walk around. Let's talk to Doug. Hey, Doug. <coughs> ah. Oh. What's up, Lee? What are you working on, Doug? I've worked up a little warning system for outside. 
How does it work? I set up trip lines at four locations, and each one triggers one of these four bells. So... So we'll know where they are and how long we have. Smart. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Think Katja can save that guy? Maybe. I mean, I know about computers, but that doesn't mean I can fix a calculator. But you probably could fix a calculator. Well, yeah. Good point. Hmm. Good point. Take it easy, Doug. I'm not giving... I'm not going to give anyone food until I can figure out what... how everyone's feeling. Will you hold the damn board steady? And he's not getting any I'm food. I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Oh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. Maybe I'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. Hey. You holding up okay, Lee? I was pretty fucked up back there. Having to cut that guy's leg off. Yeah. I just hope Kabja can save him. <laughs> you ever miss the Air Force Base? I mean, this wall isn't exactly military standard. No way I'm going back there. You saw what it was like when you guys picked me up. Completely overrun. Lily's pretty pissed at us. Listen, I know her intentions are good, but... But nothing! She's making the smart choice. Those parasites you guys brought back need to go. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Oh, yeah, no, not the axe. No, not the axe. <sighs> here, Mark, this should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? You didn't ask for it first, Come buddy. Come on, Larry. Cut Lee some slack. He knows you're just out to protect Lily. He told me so. Just like he's trying to protect Clementine. He... <sighs> oh. I just need some food. Going this long without a proper meal make anybody cranky. What the heck? It's just floating cans there. Where are you going? What's that for? Oh, that, that was my first attempt at making an alarm system. The new version is much more sophisticated. Gotcha. Gotcha. All right, let's see what else is going on. Do 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 do. Avoid the cans. How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Um. Yeah, well. Is there. Oh, yeah. Epic walk. Look at slow mo. Looks awesome. So I guess I'm going to have to talk to everyone just to make sure everyone. Oh, let's go talk to what's his face. Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. It's probably our best bet. I'm not sure that's the best idea. You gave Glenn your blessing when he left. Just asking you respect my choice as well. Yeah, but he was leaving to find his friends. Your family's right here. Well, here isn't doing us any good. You should think about coming with us, you and Clem. Mm -hmm. We need you here. We have a better chance of surviving as a group. Our best chance of surviving is to get away from the mainland. My mind is made up. Oh, really? Well, if that's the case, I don't think you're going to get much food from me. Just saying. If you're going to leave anyways. Uh, Alright guys, what are you going to do? I'm going to pause it there. So thanks for watching. And uh, we'll continue this again tomorrow. I'll see you then. Bye.